10 metal surface finishing treatment processes. First, polishing. Polishing is creating a smooth and shiny surface by rubbing it or applying a chemical treatment, leaving a clean surface with a significant specular reflection. The process of polishing with abrasives starts with a coarse grain size, then gradually proceeds to the finer ones to efficiently flatten the surface imperfections and to obtain optimal results. Second, sandblasting. Sandblasting is forcibly propelling a stream of abrasive material against a surface under high pressure to smooth a rough surface. Roughen a smooth surface. Shape a surface or remove surface contaminants. Third, wire drawing. Wire drawing is a surface treatment process that grinds the metal surface and forms lines on it so that it has a non-mirror metallic luster, like satin, and has a high decorative effect. Lines can be divided into two types based on surface effects straight lines and random lines. And continuous lines and intermittent lines can be found in straight line drawings. Fourth, anodic oxidation. Anodic oxidation is an electrochemical method for the production of an oxide film on a metallic substrate. It removes electrons from a substance and oxidizes the anode. Fifth, PVD. Physical vapor, deposition, PVD includes a variety of vacuum deposition, methods that can be used to produce thin films and coatings on substrates, including metals, ceramics, glass, and polymers. PVD is characterized by a process in which the material transitions from a condensed phase to a vapor phase, and then back to a thin film condensed phase. The most common PVD processes are sputtering and evaporation. Examples include semiconductor devices, such as thin film solar cells, microelectromechanical devices, aluminized pet film for food packaging, and so on. 6. Electroplating. Electroplating is the process of using electrodeposition to coat an object in a layer of metal. Engineers use controlled electrolysis to transfer the desired metal coating from an anode to a cathode. Common metals utilized for electroplating are cadmium, chromium, copper, gold, nickel, silver, tin, and zinc. Almost any base metal that conducts electricity can be electroplated to enhance its performance. 7. Painting. Surface treatment painting is commonly specified by engineers to enhance a part's appearance and corrosion resistance. There are many types of paint formulations to protect metal parts in a wide range of physical environments. The automotive industry has automated the process of painting cars and trucks, utilizing thousands of robot arms and producing extremely consistent results. 8. Etching. Etching is the process of using strong acid or mordant to cut into the unprotected parts of a metal surface to create a design and intaglio in the metal. In a number of modern variants such as microfabrication etching and photochemical milling, it is a crucial technique in much modern technology, including circuit boards. Ninth, Laser Engraving Laser engraving is the practice of using a laser to engrave an object and it is a process that uses optical principles for surface treatment. Most of the logos that need to be made on the metal surface are basically made by laser engraving. 10. Screen printing. Screen printing is a printing technique where a mesh is used to transfer ink onto a substrate, except in areas made impermeable to the ink by a blocking stencil. The technique is used not only for garment printing, but for printing on many other substances, including decals, clock and watch faces, balloons, and many other products. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We will share more videos related to product development in the future. For more details of our service, ozzysourcing.com.